E.G. Marshall, born Everett Eugene Gruns in 1914, was an American actor who had a successful career in film, television, and theater. Known for his distinctive voice and authoritative presence, Marshall portrayed a wide range of characters throughout his extensive career. E.G. Marshall was born on June 18, 1914, in Minnesota. He developed an interest in acting during his college years and pursued a career in theater. Marshall made his Broadway debut in 1941 in the play The Skin of Our Teeth and went on to perform its numerous stage productions, earning critical acclaim for his performance. Marshall began appearing in films in the 1950s and established himself as a versatile actor capable of taking a variety of roles. Some of his notable film credits include Twelve Angry Men in 1957, in which he portrayed Juror No. 4, The Kane Mutiny in 1954, and The Boston Strangler in 1968. He often played serious and authoritative characters, and his performances were characterized by their depth and intensity. Marshall made a successful transition to television and became a familiar voice in the medium. He appeared in numerous TV shows and miniseries, showcasing his versatility as an actor. One of his most notable television roles was as Lawrence Preston in the legal drama series The Defenders in 1961 to 1965, for which he received critical acclaim and multiple Emmy Award nominations. Marshall continued to work in television throughout his career, making guest appearances on various shows and starring in TV movies and miniseries. He also had a recurring role as the narrator in the acclaimed anthology series Mystery on PBS. Despite his success in film and television, Marshall maintained a strong connection to the stage. He appeared in numerous Broadway productions throughout his career and received Tony Award nominations for his performances in plays such as The Crucible and The Iceman Cometh. Marshall's talents and contributions to the performing arts were recognized with several awards and honors. He received a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame and was inducted into the American Theater Hall of Fame and received the National Medal of Arts in 1993. E.G. Marshall was married to Helen Wolfe from 1939 until his death in 1998. They had three children together. Marshall's legacy is one of a highly respected and accomplished actor. His powerful performances and commanding presence on screen and stage left a lasting impact on audiences. He is remembered as a versatile actor who brought depth and nuance to his roles and contributions to film, television, and theater continue to be celebrated.